What's going on YouTube, Fezzafar Media, don't forget to like, comment, share and subscribe for all latest UK media updates and story videos, keeping you updated and informed and of course follow us on Instagram at Fezzafar to get all the updates first. So guys, we got another crazy crime story today. A man 35 is jailed for 20 months for killing a DJ, father of one, by throwing a wheelie bin at him during a row in the street over late night noise. An intoxicated Stephen Robbins, 34, lobbed a blue bin at a father of one, Ryan Barry, 39, during a heated street row in Dundee. Mr. Barry was struck with an empty bin and fell forward and hit his head on a wooden fence during the incident in March. The DJ known to friends as Minnie was taken home by a friend after the incident, which was sparked when Mr. Barry confronted Robbins over the noise he was walking home from a nightclub. That was hit with a bin was later found unconscious and could not be resuscitated by paramedics. A post-mortem examination found bleeding on the brain likely to have been caused by the bin striking his head. Robbins was initially charged with murder but admitted culpable homicide. The judge said your actions caused the death of Mr. Barry, he was only 39 years of age. You have taken his father from his young son. He has a mother and a brother and sister and friends grieving his loss. On the other hand, I am satisfied that your culpability in the circumstances here was low. There was no serious violence or any intent to cause any serious injury. You are in the process of leaving when you was asked to do so and you acted on impulse recklessly when you picked up the wheelie bin and threw it towards Mr. Barry. She was satisfied as well that he had genuine remorse. Seems like a situation that got out of hand on just a night out or something where there was a little argument and someone threw sank at someone I mean, it just ended badly. Apparently, Mr. Barry was advised to go to hospital, but he refused medical attention. Whenever you're in a street fight or something, it's always best to get checked. The guy who has not been pictured, he was sentenced to 20 months at the High Court in Edinburgh. I just want to say a huge rest in peace to Ryan Barry. From what I'm hearing as well, he's a very talented DJ and didn't deserve to lose his life at such a young age. I've been covering on this channel, of course, the recent murder in Redden of Oliver Stevens, and I have got a GoFundMe page you guys can help support. I left it in the description of my last one, and any updates today on the court case, I will be updating you guys as well, so stay tuned for that. It will be on this channel. I did actually want to try and go to the trial of this and follow this case, but I couldn't get there. Of course, there's a lot of restrictions on traveling around London and stuff at the moment, but it's a crazy, crazy story, and these family are dealing with a lot right now. I'm going to be doing a donation myself over on that page. I cannot imagine what they are going through. But as for today's court case, I do expect it just to get pushed up the crown because the magistrates can't deal with something this serious in a murder, so it just get pushed up the crown where the actual court case will go ahead. But during this time, they'll still be remanded in custody until that actually goes ahead. And Crown Court, the waiting time right now is crazy. But where this is a murder investigation, it should get pushed forward a lot. But there is a lot of stuff that's been left in the loop for years now. I was waiting to go Crown Court at one point, And it's just a long, long process to go there. But I will update you guys. And make sure you watch my last video. I'll leave a link to update you fully on what happened recently.